Hey, what's up, pals? Uh, sorry, no more orange juice. I I should get a new one of those. I I made like six of them, and I just went through them, and then I was like going to make more, but then I didn't. Um, oh, let me let me make myself look a little better here. Hey, what's up? Uh, I I wrote that for the Guardian, uh, Michael Jordan's toupee. I was a writer for the Guardian US for I don't know a couple years. Um, I used to do their like football day after recap, but then they found somebody they liked more. Um, <laughs> but that's okay. Uh, you know, it's I'm not for everyone. Um, I was gonna take my hair out, but maybe not. There we go. This is, these are things I should have done before going live, but you know, it's that authenticity that you guys expect from, uh, you know, Defector Media. Um, so yeah, I don't have any personal Wing Bowl uh, disaster stories, Michael Jordan's toupee, but I did, before the 05 Super Bowl, the year the Eagles were in it, my friends went and someone threw a brick through their car windshield while they were in it. I don't, I don't know like what the backstory was for that, like how it happened, um, but yeah. Um, my mom used to go to Wing Bowl every year, like her office went, uh, <laughs> which is kind of funny. Um, I went, I don't know, I went to Wing Bowl like three times, maybe four. It was so much smaller by the last year. Um, uh, the, yeah, my mom was in a suite for Wing Bowl. So, you know, if you can get that sweet experience. I mean, I think the real thing was that she got to skip work. Um, I had a, uh, oh, let me do one thing and then I'll start this. I, I gotta say, this Sega logo, when it comes up, really brings me back. Um, it's not a Sonic game, so it's not going Sega. Um, yeah, I had a couple, I, one of my favorite things at Wing Bowl, and this is like very silly, but the, maybe it was even the last, I don't know what Wing Bowl it was, but it was right after Tom Gold had died. And you know, they have like a college division at the Wing Bowl. And there was a LaSalle kid that had like a rip, like a, like a, like a tombstone, uh, like a, you know, like a styrofoam tombstone, like a Halloween, uh, decoration. And had written "Rip Tom Gola," uh, uh, like written Tom Gola under R.I.P. and was holding it up in the air. Oh, Slums, don't spoil me. Um, is it is tonight is semifinal one? Um, do not spoil Eurovision in here, because if semifinal one was tonight, my wife and I are gonna watch it uh, later tonight probably. Oh, I got the Sixers. Maybe you can spoil it. It is only the semifinals. All right, so I'm gonna start playing. Um. As you may have noticed, uh, this game does not include Arnold Palmer. That little title screen is the only we're going to see of Palmer. Oh man, this music. So I guess we'll do a tournament, right? I mean, we'll play a little bit of it. Ooh, yep, that's me. Apparently, if you put in the name Eve, you get longer shots. No, not that. No. Wow, that's a weird O. Why is there O like that? Ooh, the World Pro Golf Tour. Is this... What a plot. Uh, oh, CZM Tal. Uh, let's remember some wing ball guys. Once <laughs> we, once in high school, we we got off at the Lansdale exit. Uh, sure. We got off at the Lansdale exit of the Turnpike and the SG Proto Tournament. Uh, so we got off at the Lansdale Turnpike exit and Tollman Joe, winner of the rah, 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 Wing Bowl, was our was our toll booth operator, and we were like, yeah, yeah, it was it was a great moment. 
Ooh, a new set of clubs. I really like SG Proto Tournament. That's Sega Genesis. Oh, Pro Tournament. Proto Ornament. Sega Genesis Pro Tournament. Whoa, look at my look at my caddy babe. Ooh, I like this game. Do I not have a driver? Okay. Oh my god. Okay. I don't know how far it's gonna go. this work how does this game work thanks for the advice ah oh really it's in the rough works i just it only went it when i mashed a oh how does this game work i guess i should have like tried this before there we go oh that's a little better Ooh, the graphics are pretty good. I'm not, I don't understand why sometimes it hits it and sometimes it doesn't. It's, it's very infuriating. All right, we're making some headway here, folks. This is me playing actual golf also. closer I think once I like make it onto the oh now I'm too far oh really it's in the rough again no I don't want the one wood man this is tough because like I have no idea like usually you get like a little helper telling you what club to use this is more like real golf Looks like Gilligan here. Why does my golfer why is my golfer suddenly dressed like Gilligan? Oh, almost. Okay. Stop, stop, stop. Oh no, that was too strong. I'm on fucking shot 12. Does it really matter?
<laughs> well, great start. All right. How am I getting no loft? All right. Do I need to hit down or something? I guess I should have used an iron. I was a little closer to that. Just doomed to go over no matter what. Get in. Oh! Oh, who cares if it's a double bogey? I pitched it in. All right. This, <laughs> this hole is on the abyss. Oh, wait. I don't want to do... Wish it told me how long my clubs went. Is there a way to get that? Oh. It's not great advice. Just tell me what club to use. go any closer I hate this game yeah like the golf games are usually good because it tells you like sort of what clubs to use you don't really know need to know how to play golf in order to play these games but like obviously i don't i don't know how to play golf so Thank you. 
Oh, come on. Oh no, the bunker. Yeah, Hurricane. I'm that's what I'm trying to do. It's really weird. It's really like it's if you wait to, till it's too close, you can't get it up that high, um, and it just resets. So, yeah. Nope. Oh. <sighs> Not a nice shot. I now hate this reporter. Now I know how people feel about the media. I'm not quite sure what happened here. This is fine. Hey! Alright, maybe I'm finally getting it on the... Maybe I'm finally figuring out how to get it on the green. Or in the air, I mean. A little far, but thank you to uh, Rob for telling me how to play the game. Slurms, there's a there's a thing in wrestling called the seagull pop, which was a thing that WWE used for forever that kind of sounded like a seagull. Not a good putt. Yeah, if you search on YouTube, like, seagull pop i think there's like a, a whole thing about it this looks very familiar to the previous one it's okay The advice is so terrible. Oh, let's try the other sound effects. Nope. I have no idea what club I should be using.
too far. I think the graphics are pretty good. Yeah, I think the graphics are pretty good, huh? The wind really affects shots that are like even like so close to the ground that there, it probably wouldn't be an issue. Ooh, thank you for uh, the manual. <laughs> I try to play these just blind, but uh. Oh my god, the manual is so long! Alright, thank you to uh, Postmodernism for that. Uh, Dad, too. No, uh, that's a new one, though. Bass Pro Shop. Um, yeah, I just have a lot of sneakers. Usually I get Foot Locker. Um, but then I also have this doll of uh, Pamela Anderson, because I found it at a, one of those uh, Instagram accounts that uh, sells you the crap that they found at the flea market. Oh, I'm pretty close though. Ah! And now it's like way too far, right? Of course it is. Oh, all right. At least I'm. You should have been more careful. These are like the most impossible putts here. Like what? Like how, how am I supposed to get that? This one's going to be tougher, I think. All right. Ooh, I do. I also remember reading the manual on the way home from the game. Uh, wow. This is really going well for me. Alright, 191 yards. I should be using maybe the number one iron. Let's look at the wind. Yeah, I'm going to do use the one. Well, I'll be a little low, so if I use a four wood, that's like 200. Okay.
I'm going for it. Oh! A birdie from the rough! Finally! Plus 26. We're doing it here, folks. All right. Thank you to... Uh, all right, so it took me eight holes to get a birdie. I did not think it was going to be that quick. So, yeah. Hundred and eighty one yards remaining. Okay, I'll do the I'll do the four wood again. Well, it's gonna be a little short. Okay. Stop, stop, stop. All right, all right. <laughs> Thanks, uh, that puzzle guy says, this music is kind of reminding me of what they used to play on The Price is Right during a showcase that didn't have anything cool in it. And that sounds pretty accurate to me as well. <sighs> you should have been more careful, oh. Short putts are definitely tougher in this game. What? Did, did all of you just see that too? Or did I like... Did I do the wrong drugs this morning? What, what the hell is that? Whoa! What is... The classic golf coffee break. And then... And then it was even weirder. <laughs> what? So this is a localization of a Japanese game. But the localization had... Uh, the localization had... The had a Japanese golfer in it, and he was also not in the game. <laughs> Imagining a super horned up Arnold Palmer demanding those animations stay in the game. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I want to use a different club. Okay, wait. I'm going to use the advice. 107 yards. That means I should use my 8 iron, maybe? Do I have an 8 iron? Yeah, I do. All right, the wind really took this one, huh? No, it's not. It's on the fringe.
<laughs> All right. We are on oh, hole number 11. All right, 149 yards. I should be using like uh, five iron. I don't know why I'm saying these out loud. I like that you have to click through when it shows you what the, like, oh, my, oh, my ball's on the tee on the first shot. I had no idea. How did, how did my ball, <laughs> that bounced awfully high. Yeah, it just says total yards. I'm not sure the the menu. I'm not sure how uh, even accurate it is. I like that the here's the like. <laughs> this is actually what the manual says. Hitting distance of clubs. Here's a more scientific approach to selecting your clubs. Scientific. Now you can choose a club based on the distance you must cover, okay? This won't be exact depending on other conditions like wind, but it's close enough. Sure, scientific, close enough. Those are terms that go together. All right. There been a lot of par five holes, or am I just misremembering? Oh, still in the fairway. Good. All right, seventy-eight yards remaining. It's pitching wedge time. Too far again. Is this the same exact? This is the same exact green as last time. <sighs> All right. Oh no, it's got different uh, reads. Oh, come on. Come on. I'm not going to read the manual to see if there's any other re either easier way to putt. One of you will have to. I can address the Tony Luke tax fraud scandal. So they've been in a feud for a long time. And according to the government, which who knows, uh, that feud, which involved, which led to Tony Luke Jr. running the uh, franchise Tony Luke's spots and, um, and Tony Luke Sr. keeping the ones in South Philly, the original, and the one in Wildwood Crest. Um, and... Or maybe it's North Wildwood. No, I think it's actually the crest, oddly enough. Um, and so during that feud, the the Tony Luke Sr. was like worried that this was going to get out. The 
they had like a weird complicated system of paying their stampers um that led to them like getting some of their pay and then giving some back it was yeah so anyway oh no they've been in a feud for a while and so uh that in addition to what i assume is his uh good nature uh is is why uh tony luke jr is not uh is not is was not convicted or they're about to pay uh yeah, paying staff under the table to avoid payroll taxes. It seemed very complicated. Like, they, uh, they, like, would pay, they would, like, pay almost nothing and then get cash or, like, a cash app type thing. Yeah, it seems, seems like this was destined to be caught. Oh, no, no, no. 87 yards remaining. All right. That wind, man. Way too far. All right, I think I'm slowly starting to figure out this game. Maybe you should have done it before I streamed it. But you know what? That's that's this. That's how we work here at uh, Defector Media. <laughs> Great stuff. I think I'm going to catch Hal. doesn't say it's in the fairway it just says the fairway should i hit it right into these trees i think i should right i mean that would be the smart thing to do uh, 146 yards all right i'll use a five iron It worked! Alright, another birdie putt. Yay! That's two birdies. Hal, look out, Hal. I'm gonna catch ya. Five iron is the right call, scientifically. All right, 182 yards. Okay, I'm going to use my one iron. Another wild bounce. Let's go for it. Oh, I need to go a little harder. Ooh, a birdie followed by a par.
This course seems dangerous. There are lots of cliffs. I guess that's not unusual. Just on the fairway. All right, 125 yards remaining. All right, we'll go with a seven iron. I would like a happy Gilmore golf game. I feel like that would be pretty good. I was thinking the other day, speaking of my CJ Parker doll behind me, there really should have been a Baywatch video game. Like, I, I, I mean, like, I assume since it was, like, a tie-in game in the 90s, it would have been something terrible. Like, I don't know, like a surfboarding competition. But, like, you could do an RPG. You could do uh, just, like, a some sort of saving life competition. I don't know. Oh, little short. Oh, come on. Maybe Happy Gilmore just hits it so far that it doesn't matter that there are dog legs because he just clears it over the... over whatever boundaries are there. I don't, I don't quite think that works, but look, I'm... Adam Sandler, the trailer for Adam Sandler's Hustle came out today. Uh, it was very funny that a German arena is very clearly the Palestra, uh, Penn's gym. Um, it's filmed in Philly, apparently, so that's nice. He was here last year filming it. Oh well. 117 yards. Okay. Oh man, it's well short. green here is it a tea box for another hole like way too hard i just forgot what i was doing for a second done oh it's 550 oh we're in the last hole all right folks <laughs> we've done it we've gotten through this game that i've struggled with which is pretty common occurrence on this stream but you know stop don't go in the don't go in the water oh okay Thank you. 
Go get in. Oh, stop now. Or actually keep going because it'll make the butt easier. All right, now it's made it harder. All right, can I end this on a par? Probably not. All right. <laughs> I wonder if I'll be in the award ceremony. Mr. Dan, a course favorite, ended the game in a disappointing 16 place. Oh, oh well. It's great that I'm tied with someone else. Yeah, don't worry. I am not going to do, I'm not going to save this, this game. Ooh, the Pwn Classic. Okay, well, I'm not going to continue playing. I did win uh, $3,000. Um, so I'm not going to continue playing. Um, but that was fun. Um, I really struggled. Um, but I definitely enjoyed playing this game. I feel like if I kept playing it, I could master it. But maybe not. Um, so I'm going to go. Yeah, it's only been 50 minutes, but there's not really any time to do anything else. I'm definitely not playing another game. Um, it looked like there were some cheats on the website, but I couldn't really, on Game Facts, but I couldn't really get them to work. Um, so, yeah. So thanks for tuning in. Uh, Normal Gossip merchandise, if you listen to our wonderful podcast uh, by Kelsey and Alex. Um, I have some merchandise for it coming out tomorrow uh, morning. So go uh, go look at that if you're so inclined. Um, also, Defector Rec right above me. I'm pointing to the right space now if you're inclined for that. Um, and if not, whatever. Um, all right. Have a good evening, fellas and ladies. <laughs>